Hey guys, welcome back to another video. It's the educator here. We're doing something a little bit different today. We're actually going to be organizing a family member's pantry. They're not looking for anything TikTok or mm, Instagram look. They just want something that's functional, organized, and something that works for them. My first stop to shop is Home Goods. This is where I'm starting the small pantry organizing journey. They have a good variety of organizers and baskets to pick from. Now waking up beside you and holding you till we forget it all. How could I know there was no second chances like Tommy? So come home, why won't you reappear? Things that I said came out totally wrong. Can't speak of the truth when it's time. My next stop is Costco. There's one specific product I'm looking for, so I hope it's here. And as you can see, Costco had what I was looking for. A set of two clear cereal containers. All right, and here's some of the containers that we've gotten so far. All these containers here are from Home Goods. We've got, of course, the Lazy Susans. One of my favorite products right now is Lazy Susans. I believe that people can have these everywhere in their house for organization. But again, these are from Home Goods. We've got Home Goods. Most all the stuff I got is from Home Goods. And then I have a few things from Marshalls and Marshalls. Home Goods. The baskets are from Home Goods. But these two baskets that I got, that I found, they are actually from Ross. And we've got the cereal containers. And those are the poppers. And those are from Costco. They were two, two in a box, two for $19.99 from Costco. Notice that I did not take any of the tags off. I wanna make sure that I'm going to use them before I actually take the tags off and wash them. Here is what the pantry looks like right now. Oh,
even though this is a small pantry, you can see there's a lot of stuff that was in there. Huh. Keep loose and sleep while driving in the backseat. And before I start organizing, I decided to add another project. I decided to cover the wire shelves. So here you'll see me and my helper getting the foam boards cut. Don't mind our workshop. I was going to do it in the garage, but we had last minute changes. There goes my help, deciding to do a dance party instead. decided where all the containers were going to go and which containers we were going to use. So here you'll see we have Mimi washing all of the containers. Finally done with all the cuts to cover the wire shelves. Now just to cover it. Here you'll see that I'm covering the foam board with a vinyl sheet. I chose a white one, but there are a lot of other choices that you can choose out of. And here is the finished look after doing the shelves. Just gives them a nice finished look and not having to see the wires. chose sheets of letters from Hobby Lobby to label all the organizers. And here we go, getting the pantry back together.
Okay, guys, we are finally done. And this is it, the final reveal. As you can see, I did keep their door organizer and just cleaned it up. Here is a reminder of what it looked like before. And the fresh look after. Leave a comment below. Let me know what you guys liked or let me know what you would have done differently. We appreciate you watching the NNKs. We'll see you in the next vlog.